Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, I will show you how to design modern home, modern real estate banner in Photoshop. First, I will create a document. I will keep this measurement in pixel. I will keep weight 2000. Then I will keep height 2000. I will keep regulation 300 and I keep this color mode in RGB because it's for weight. this image uh, i will increase this image size that's why i have to go edit option then free transform now i will increase image size Here I will draw circle I will change the fill color, I will keep white I will copy this one by pressing Ctrl G. Now I will select this one by pressing Ctrl V. It's shortcut of free transform. Now I will decrease the ellipse size. I will change this ellipse size color so that we can recognize it easily. Now I will select both by pressing Ctrl and now I will copy these two shapes by pressing Alt and Shift key. I will copy another one by pressing Alt and Shift key. Here I will use three image. First I will use this background image. I will keep this one in the middle. Now I will select this image by pressing Ctrl T. I will decrease this image size. I will keep this image in the middle of the circle. Now I will keep this image under the circle. Here I keep this image and now I will I will keep I will apply here creeping. I will apply here marks. That's why I will click right click on the image and then create clipping marks. And in the same way I will do the stop three. I will bring this image on top of the circle i will select this one by pressing ctrl t now i will increase image size again i will click right click on the image and then create clipping mask and another one here. I will select the image by pressing Ctrl T. Now I will increase image size. I will keep this image in the middle of the circle. Now I will down this image.
here I will right click on the image and then I will create within mask. We done our our image work now. I will select both first. I will click here and then holding shift key I will click top layer. That's um, this is how I select all layer in a time. Now I will press Ctrl G for group all this layer. It's shortcut. Now I will rename this one background. Now I'm going to log this layer so that when I will work on text, it will not remove or change position. Here I will draw a rectangle. I will keep this rectangle under the background layer. I will rename this one. I will keep this layer name in TJ. Now I will change rectangle this rectangle fill color i pick this rectangle color from the image that's why i will see i drop work and then i click on this area and now here you can see this color is changed now for now i will apply this color in this a rectangle that's why I will press Alt back space. Now I will keep this rectangle under the under these two image. That's why I will press Ctrl and hard bracket starting. Now I will decrease this rectangle opacity. I will keep 55 now it's okay now I will lock this one now I will type here here I am using Babas new font I will change this font color I will keep white I will decrease font size I will select this text by pressing Ctrl T. Now I will increase text size. Now I will draw a ellipse by pressing Alt Shift. Now I will type here. I will change the position of text. I will keep this right element, left element. I will type here 5 bedroom. I will select this text by pressing Ctrl A and I will decrease a little bit of this layer of this text size. Now I will select this ellipse and layer. That's why I am pressing Ctrl for selecting this both layer. Now I will copy this one by pressing Alt Shift key. I will copy another one. That's why again I am doing the same method I for copy and paste I hold alt and shift 
now I will change this name Now I will create a rectangle. I will change this rectangle fill color. I will keep this one. Now I will copy this and by pressing Ctrl G. Now I will bring. I will bring. I will down this rectangle a little bit. Now I will change this rectangle color. That's why I am selecting this. And then I will pick up color from here. Here I will type Now I will select this layer and I will keep this layer in the put in the middle of the rectangle. Now I will select this all by holding shift key and now I will group this all layer by pressing Ctrl G. Now I will rename this one text. This is for this tutorial. If you like this tutorial don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you for watching